On Thursday, we were gathered. Pastors from Kisi County. In the commissioner and chiefs and leaders of the government of Fukuja Sub County at Ogembo and the bishops and the apostles and the pastor said we are requesting Apostle Murwabe to speak to us the word of God and therefore on Thursday I went to Ogembo I led the service outside the market but I had prayed for that day that God because we are doing a peace caravan may there be a sign that our prayer has been received accepted and acted I spoke to them the word that God gave me and as I took the microphone to pray my eyes were closed as usual but a white dove came from nowhere and it passed in front of me I never saw it myself I came to see it in the video but the bishops whose eyes were open saw it I don't know where it came from but I know why it came it came to confirm that now peace is in Kisi we have put that in our YouTube you can see it as I was finishing to pray then I understood that at the moment of prayer when the prayer is so sincere, so fervent, so deep, even if it's a prayer of one minute, heaven will open. God will show her. You will have a confirmation and you will hear God. I pray for you that after this day, may your prayer be heard and be acted. Glory to Jesus. Many people have always prayed and they have never known whether God ever spoke to them. When I started the ministry, God told me, son, every time you preach, this will be a sign. And this has been going on for the last seven years. Every time I minister in a healing crusade or anywhere, God releases water from above. Every time, if you have ever been in my meetings, it has to come even for three minutes before the healing starts because that's a sign of the presence of the holy spirit the holy spirit when you are so connected he can manifest himself physically i believe many of you are getting connected to me as sons and daughters of the spirit may your prayer never bounce from this hour in jesus name May your prayer be accepted every time you pray in Jesus' name. A bishop called me and asked me, man of God, did you see the dove that came as you were finishing to pray? I said, I couldn't see it. My eyes were closed. I couldn't see. But when I asked God, why? Why have you permitted the dove to come? It is not about my bigness or the size of the ministry. It's about a commitment to the calling. You might not be known, but God can make you popular. When God is with you and you are so consistent with him, everyone that is against you will be compelled to support you at a particular time. I mean, be consistent. People have a duty to speak what they want. But your consistency in God will compel them to speak what he wants. Praise God. Whoever succeeded against God, you have an example? Nobody. Nobody. I am not God. 
But he who is in me is greater than he who is in the world. 